Hi, I'm Nate Johnson, owner and head trainer at Steel String Training, where we believe in prehab, rehab, and doing what you thought was impossible. When it comes to recovery, we're frequently and pretty much always talking about uh, bodily recovery. We're talking about physical recovery. We want to make sure the muscles grow, make sure the muscles are repaired, make sure they're uh, repaired so they can be stronger than they were. Uh, we want to make sure that we are primed and ready for our next uh, athletic event, whatever it may be. We focus a lot on physical um, restoration, physical recovery, and I think that's great. I think that's something that we need to be focusing on. However, I think there's also the aspect of uh, mental recovery, uh, mental rest. And so sometimes we, in the fitness industry, we get this idea that we need to constantly be you know, training at 100% and mentally just dial in our, our nutrition 100% and um, just focus all our energy into those things. That's fine, that's great. I think we should all go through periods of that throughout the year. Um, even if you're just casually participating in, in fitness, you know, working out a few days a week, trying to get a little leaner, get a little healthier, get a little stronger. So, uh, but I think it's good to go through times uh, where you test your mind, um, test your willpower, and go uh, with an extreme diet, or try to get really lean, or uh, focus for 12 weeks on building as much muscle as you can. Whatever it is, I think it's important to go through periods of that. But just as important as those periods of uh, strenuous uh, mental prep and planning, I think it's just as important to make sure that we take time off, whether you go through um, just more of a moderate intensity workout where you're not just grinding day in and day out. Um, that'll give your, your body a rest, but it'll also give you um, a rest mentally. Kind of back off on the nutrition a little bit. Make sure you're still eating healthy, um, following good nutrition principles, but not necessarily you know, counting every single calorie that goes in your mouth all the time. And then, uh, just like you have the deload week, uh, take a week off from, from the gym and uh, use this as a time not just to um, give your body physical rest, but also your mind. Think about other things. Don't obsess over the gym. Uh, take time to get away from it all. And what I found is this will always put you in a better position to attack that next goal 10 times better and more effectively than you would if you were constantly trying to perform at 100% because you simply can't. So, while you're giving your body a rest, make sure to give your mind a rest as well.